record rain has set the stage for a thrilling return of Perth's greatest river race with the Avon descent kicking off in perfect conditions. The wild white water proving a challenge for some. Wild waters cause thrills and spills at the Avon descent. <laughs> Record rain causing levels to surge, creating perfect conditions for WA's greatest river race. Oh, it was a hell of a ride. It's a, it was fairly foggy and it's bloody freezing. But it was just <laughs> so fast because the water flow is just amazing, you know. 600 competitors taking part on day one of the event, back in action after it was cancelled by the pandemic last year. I was born on the Avon over in York and it's been a huge part of my life. The day kicking off with foggy conditions, boats floating through the mist. Out of northern the fog was terrible and then the hands started to freeze up. The fast moving torrent proving a challenge for some. 15 year old Elsie Leonard had to be rescued when her boat flipped. You right? I got you. I got you. I was shaking a lot. Um, Elsie obviously had a little bit of water on her lung. And um, she's OK now, but, yeah, the stress has gone down. The opening of the 124-kilometre event from northern to Perth faster than ever. Terry Russell's crossed the finishing line 18 times. He says this year tops them all. We've cut off two hours from day one. Usually we'd finish, I've finished in six hours before, and I've finished in four hours and 21 minutes today. We're clipping along at over 70 kilometres an hour, about 10 centimetres yeah, off so. the water. Water levels are the highest they've been in nearly 20 years. It means paddlers can go even faster. Some boaters have actually pulled out in fear of getting injured. Crossing the line to spend a night camping. Beautiful sunny day. Time for a beer. Day two and 72 kilometres lies ahead. Alexia Pesce, Nine News.